Hey girl friends, I'm Bianca Renee. You're watching Bianca Renee today. And today I'm gonna share with you the top 10 curly hair accessories you need in your life. Having curly hair products is one thing, but you also need the accessories to enhance those beautiful curls to make them look just a little bit better than they already do. So let's start off with the beginning of the day so you don't wake up with frizzy curls. And that's by sleeping on a silk pillowcase. This is my pillowcase, as you can see, because literally my name's on it. And this is from Lily Silk. This portion of today's video is sponsored by Lily Silk, so I have a bunch of different items to show you from them. But I love that you can get a little customized name on here so you know it's yours. So I got this silver gray color to match my bedspread, but then I also got one in black. And I also got this really pretty dark teal color. So depending on the color of your bed, they have a bunch of different colors to choose from. But the reason why it is so important to sleep on a silk pillowcase is because if you use a cotton pillowcase, it's gonna create a lot of friction, which is going to lead to frizz. But if you have a silk pillowcase, it's just gonna rub on there. You can be a wild sleeper and your curls will still look beautiful. This is a very common curly hair tip. At first I was like, okay, you know, I'll do it. But then there was one time where I went on vacation and I forgot to pack my silk pillowcase and my hair was frizzy every day. And I was like, what is happening? And then I realized I didn't have my pillow. So I think it's super important to have a silk pillowcase in your bed, take one when you travel, and another little tip you could do is you grab your pillowcase when your hair is wet, maybe straight out the shower, and while it's drying, you could put it over your shoulders like a continental soldier. <laughs> and not only do you look like a curly superhero, you actually are saving your curls from drying with frizz. My next Lily Silk item are silk scrunchies. These will also come in handy with your nighttime sleep. So when I go to bed, I like to put my hair up in a pineapple hairstyle, which is the best way to protect your curls at night, which means you put all of your curls in the front of your head. Hopefully you're not wearing big hoops like this because that's just complicated. Then you put them in your silk scrunchie just one time, boop, and that is how I wear my hair to sleep. The reason why it's good to use a silk scrunchie is because when you take it out, it doesn't leave any tangles, it doesn't snag, and it just pulls off nice and easy, not leaving any like harsh indentation when it's time to refresh. I also notice less breakage because it's not snagging any of my curls. So these scrunchies are also from Lily Silk. I'll link them below. And my last Lily Silk item I wanted to share with you, if you have short curly hair that you can't really put into a pineapple yet, I would suggest getting a silk bonnet. Now, if you have short curly hair, you could just stick all your hair in here. If you want to be double safe and you have longer hair, you could first put your hair in a pineapple. Then I'm gonna stick all of my hair in the silk bonnet. like so oh yeah this is nice and big and what i like about this bond is that it has these little ties so for some extra security you can tie it in a knot in the front or you can bring it around here do a little knot so this makes it nice and secure so it won't slip off while you're sleeping at night then in the morning you could take off your bonnet take out your scrunchie and your curls will look beautiful so depending on the length of your curls, if you need a silk pillowcase, silk scrunchies, or a silk bonnet, all these are available at lilysilk.com. And they also gave me a promo code, so you guys use my code to save some money. The next curly hair must-haves are diffusers. My favorite diffusers are the types that are collapsible, so it makes it really great for travel, easy to store in your bathroom, and they have a really wide nozzle so that you could fit all of your curls on there. The first one I've ever used was by the Curly Co. Eventually, this part kind of started to fall out and it's feeling like a little loose, but then I got the one by Rizos Curls, which actually feels a lot more durable. And I mean, it's pink, so it's super cute. And then I also have one by House of Curls, which is like this pretty coral color. If you look at all three, they're pretty similar. If I had to pick which one was most durable, I'd probably pick the Rizos Curls one. As you can see, it has these like bigger 
ridges. I don't know. It just feels really sturdy. Um, I only have a promo code for Risos Curls. If you guys want to get one, you could use my code. But at the end of the day, they all basically do the same thing. It just depends on which color you want and which brand you want to support. The next curly hair must have is a water bottle. No, not to drink, but one for your hair. So I have two here. This one is by Curl Keeper. It's their H2O. It says the best water bottle for fabulous curls right on the bottle. This one holds 12 fluid ounces. And literally this morning, I just picked up the Pattern Beauty water bottle, which, oh, it doesn't tell me how many ounces. I feel like it's the same size. Let's see how it works. Oh, that's nice. I've been using this one a lot, so I feel like it's starting to wear out on me. But the best thing about these types of like Mr. Water bottles, that even after you spray it, it keeps going. So, so it's nice to have that continuous mist of water. Now let's get into brushes. You might also want to get those edges laid. So I have not... Uh, done mine today so let's do them right now i finally picked up the edge control by pattern beauty so we're going to see if this works for the first time and i also got their edge control brush this is supposed to be the bees knees Ooh, that's pretty fancy comes in a little case wow that's nice double-sided one has some very coarse bristles and this side has a little comb it has a little place for your finger i like that or you can get the cheap one that you've probably seen like on amazon that looks like this bristles on top small comb on the bottom although it has very strong bristles it actually feels really nice let's see what this comb does okay that's cute i kind of feel like this comb size might be better because it's very, very small. Yeah, that looks nice. I have to keep trying with this comb. I feel like the bristles might be too far apart where this one you get like very skinny little waves. So those are your two legit options or you could take a real old school and just grab a toothbrush. Any toothbrush that you no longer use, this is a children's toothbrush from the 99 cent store. It gets the job done. Let's talk about detangling our hair. I do use my fingers majority of the time, but if I don't have time and I really wanna get some really good definition, I'll grab my favorite brush of all time, which is the Be Hairful brush. This brush will glide through your curls like no other. I've talked about this in several other videos, but it just does such a good job at detangling. When I first saw it, I was like, mm. I don't know, these bristles look very intimidating. What's this plastic thing here? And I was terrified to put it in my hair. But when I used it in the shower, while my hair was wet with conditioner, it just glided through every single knot. Usually you're supposed to start from the bottom, work your way up. I could even start at the top of my head and pull down and it would glide through. So. This brush is a 10 out of 10. I do have a promo code for this one as well, but my second favorite curly hair brush for detangling would be by Rizos Curls. This is the Rizos Curls Detangling Flexi Brush. So it's pretty cool how all the bristles like literally separate like that. And this also does a really good job at detangling without like it snagging on your hair. I also think it's a little bit easier to clean than the Be Hairful brush because I mean, look at the bristles. It's it's plastic, it's just really easy, and it's pink, and it's cute. Before detangling in the shower, a new thing that I've added to my wash routine are the Scalp Massage Brushes by Mina. My curl friend, Amanda Walker, just started her own brand. Shout out to Amanda, congratulations. But Mina Beauty has just launched these shampoo scalp massage brushes. So this is the rose quartz color, and this is black. I love that they're matte. Like, just look how pretty these are. Aren't they cute? So I got both colors. One is $14.99, or you can get two of them in a little bundle for $24.99, so that's what I did. And what you do is you apply your shampoo either on the brush or on your scalp, and then you just go like this, and it's going to gently exfoliate your scalp, can help with any product buildup, increase blood circulation, which is also going to help with hair growth. So I've used these scalp massage brushes before. The other ones that I used actually vibrated, so you had to put batteries in them. But if I'm being completely honest, 
At some point, my battery would die and then I'd forget about it in the shower and then I'd never replace the battery, so therefore I didn't end up using the vibration anyway. So although these don't vibrate, I don't miss it. So I'm gonna leave one in my shower, one outside the shower, so I can use it when I'm applying my shampoo, and I'm also gonna be using this when I apply oils to my scalp at night. So whether you're using this on wet or dry hair, it's always good to give yourself a nice little scalp massage to encourage hair growth. Next up are these scrunchies by Goody. I've talked about these before as well. These are the Ouchless Forever scrunchies. I just bought a brand new pack because I just can't get enough. They never have ever. Ow! Mama say, Mama saw, Mama kusa. I'm okay. I'm okay. These are the only hair ties that I will use when it comes to doing tight styles. You know, when you're doing a ponytail, you go around once, you go around twice, and then it usually pops and it just ruins your whole day. You have an attitude, your hairstyle is ruined. I have trust issues because of scrunchies. But these right here have never, ever popped on me. They are super stretchy. Instead of it being connected with just a little piece or sliver of glue or that silver like metal band that usually gets stuck in our curls. It just has this little bead and these have never ever broke on me. And that is just one last thing to stress about. In order to get our hair even bigger, you also are going to need a hair pick. Once again, we got some options. This is from the 99 cent store, which is actually pretty cute glitter you know you like it i think i got maybe two or three of these in a pack look at that one dollar no 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 99 cents or you can get a little fancy and get one from maybe pattern beauty that comes in this little carrying case and looks like this so it's pretty sleek it's pretty pretty stylish at the end of the day do they do the same exact thing yes the pattern beauty pick is only nine dollars but technically i could get 18 of these for the price of one of these so get whatever you can afford but it just helps to just get that extra volume so your curls look even bigger oh yeah oh i also have the rizos curls pick which is in my purse i think that was like 12 dollars, but it's pink and also really cute and the last curly hair must have i want to share with you is this Hot Head Heat Cap by Thermal Hair Care. This is what I use to deep condition every single week. So because I have low porosity hair, that means my hair shafts are pretty much sealed shut. And then when you add heat, good heat, not a straightener, like steam heat to your hair, your hair follicles will open up making it even easier for your deep conditioner to get into your hair strands. So to apply a little bit of heat to my hair in a safe way, I get this flaxseed hair cap that you put in the microwave. You put in the microwave for 45 seconds, you flip it inside out, do another 45 seconds, flip it again, 45 seconds, and then it'll be nice and hot. Then underneath here, you put your wet deep conditioned curls in a plastic shower cap. You put your hair in the plastic shower cap to protect your bonnet from getting dirty. And then you put the bonnet on top of your hair in the shower cap like so. Then your hair is gonna be in a nice little jacuzzi of moisture. So these are all of my curly hair accessory must-haves. Which ones do you wanna add to your collection? Which ones do you already have that you love? Let me know your must-haves in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I post new videos every week, so if you hit that little bell, you will be notified as soon as I post a new video. You also can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok at Ms. Bianca Renee. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching Bianca Renee today. Yeah.